So go on then, how was she? Oh, Diane, I'm not answering that. Do you know what? I never knew she was that way in clown. Well, she was for one night only. Tracy Barlow, for one night only, live at the Palladium, with the emphasis being on lady. <laughs> so, how did you know she was up for it then? Um, I don't know. It uh, took us both by surprise a bit. Mm. Rather you than me, that's for sure. <laughs> oh, hello. Hi. Hi. This is a bit awkward, isn't it? <laughs> Can I have a word? What with her, Mommy? With you. Right, yes. Um, well, I'm going to put this in the car, then. I take it you... Is it safe? Are oh, you avoiding her? Oh, you know what it's like. No, not really. Yeah. Okay. Um, I ran into Sally on my way back, and she's invited me to spend an hour in the hot tub over lunch. Ugh, you don't let the grass grow. Well, boys are in court. You know, we could celebrate my last day in the office. You fancy it? Would that be safe? From Sally's wittering, I doubt it. Oh, go on, then. No funny business, though. Oh, Leanne, you're not my type. What, and Tracy is? Look, can I say something? Oh, am I about to be told off? It's just a bit tedious. You know, I like men, I like women. Hey, I'm not poking funny at your sexuality. It's more the fact that you went for Tracy Barlow. And can I tell you something? No, I'm going to get told off. She's a married woman, so you can forget the moral high ground. True. Right. Well, I'm glad we sorted that then. I'm still on for the hot tub, though, yeah? Yeah, totally. <laughs> cool. <laughs> oh, I've always been spontaneous. <laughs> I mean, who cares if it's a Friday lunchtime? Who needs a special occasion to jump into a bath with your friends? <laughs> Tracy. Paula. Yeah. Steve. How did you get in? Tim gives us a key. Oh. Do you know what? Don't worry about it. We'll come back another day. Oh, no. You're here now. You don't mind if they join us, do you? No, no. I don't mind. Do you mind, Paula? Um, what? No, I think we'll leave it. No, come on. The more the merrier. Yeah, come, Trace. Put the freeze in here. <laughs> Look at Steve. He's like the cat who's got the cream. Come on, hop in. Oh, coming in now. Get me flip flops, Oh, it's just like Roman times. I feel like we should all be eating grapes. <laughs> well, as long as nobody starts playing footsie, you know who you are. Oh, she would play footsie with me. Oh, I bet she would. You know, I sometimes sit out here and I think, got a hot tub and a horse, you know, from such humble beginnings. So were you in here on New Year's Eve then? New Year? No! No, Tim was poorly. Do you remember? Yeah, we just had a quiet one. What did you get up to on New Year's? Oh, you know, this nap. Oh, she's free and easy. She didn't have anybody to answer to. <laughs> You're quiet, Tracy. Am I? How was your New Year's Eve? It was fine. So where did you end up? Because Steve was working, didn't he? Oh, um... Went to the Rovers. Oh, the Rovers. If I had a pound for every New Year's Eve I'd spent in the Rovers. Yeah, happens to most of us, I'm afraid. <laughs> Didn't fancy a change, then? What? You know, something different. Well, I bet the devil you know, innit? Oh, I don't know. What do they say? A change is as good as a rest? Mm. Don't worry, I'm leaving. Can't take it anymore. No, you can't do that. They're going to wonder why. No, it's fine. I've already told them it's a work thing. She said she wasn't going to say anything. <sighs> Have you seen her? Can't stop grinning. Mm, I'd never have invited her if I'd known, obviously. Mm, trying to get your claws into her and all, are you? Oh, yeah, of course, like I prayed on you. You did, Paula. Oh. I was drunk. I've said this before. You took advantage of me. Oh, come on. This is a big joke to you, isn't it? But this is my marriage. As far as I recall, it was your marriage that was the problem, and that's how comes you ended up in bed with me. Tell me you're joking. Don't look at me like that. Tracy Barlow, have you completely lost your mind? That were a cheap trick. All those cracks. Mm. Well, to be fair, I'd have probably done the same thing if I was a... Are you all right? Oh, yeah, yeah, never better. I was stuck in a hot tub with my husband, the mother of one of his children, a woman I went to bed with, and a nosy as cow in Weatherfield. Is there anything I can do? 
I think you've done enough already. Didn't actually ask you to follow me here. No, I came here because I was concerned about you. Paula, can you just leave? Well, it's not like I'm going to pounce on you or something. Katie! Just go. Get into the bathroom. Well, he's not going to suspect me. No, he'll jump to the wrong conclusion or the right conclusion. Please, just get in the bathroom. Oh, Tracy, this is absurd. Tracy? Yeah? What happened to you? Oh, do you know, Steve, I could really feel a headache coming on. I had to get away. <gasps> From me? Do you have a one-night stand on New Year's Eve? 